It's Wednesday, March 20th. Good morning. I'm Dan Blakely with your daily kickstart from Barry 360. Sure, we get the mildest winter on record, and then on the first full day of spring, squall watches. Potential for up to 35 centimeters of snow in some parts of our region. Environment Canada's David Phillips, not surprised by this at all. Typically, we do get, on average, in the Barry area, after the middle of March, we still get, on average, about 28 centimeters of snow. Big dumps, he says not out of the question for late April and early May. A 62-year-old Ontario woman says her brother has died in northern Gaza after weeks spent searching for food and shelter while he waited for word from the federal government about whether he could come to Canada. Says she found out through a Facebook post on March 4th that her brother had died about two months after she applied to a federal program in hopes of securing Canadian visas for him and his 25-year-old daughter. Mourners held funeral prayers this morning outside a hospital in central Gaza for 20 28 people killed in three Israeli airstrikes last night on urban refugee camps. New Zealand says it will ban disposable e-cigarettes and raise financial penalties for those who sell such products to minors. The move comes less than a month after the government repealed a unique law enacted by the previous government to phase out tobacco smoking by imposing a lifetime ban on young people buying cigarettes. Finland, still the happiest country in the world, seventh year in a row it tops the world happiness list. Denmark, Iceland, Sweden, and Israel round out the top five. Canada, 15th. Down from 13 a year ago, the U.S. fell out of the top 20 for the first time since the happiness report began in 2012. Flurries and squalls today, high near zero. That's your kickstart for March 20th. We're back again tomorrow. Until then, remember, strong people don't have attitudes, they have standards.